Hi everybody! Today we're going to be doing our April favorites and today it is the Cookie and Amanda show. Cookie is here to show you some of her April favorites. She's purring already because she's so excited. So let's go ahead and get right into it. This is my favorites box where I go around and collect some favorite things. So we're going to start with cookies so that she can go back upstairs if she would like to. Let's move our box over a little bit. First, we'll take Cookie out. She's one of the April favorites. Okay, this is Cookie's first April favorite. Now, these are called Temptation Mix-Ups. This is, if you look at the picture, it's bacon and eggs. Okay, sit. No, sit. Sit. Oh, you, nope. No, <laughs> sit. Good. Ooh, that's a good girl. Paw. Good girl. Okay, that was her first favorite. She really, for some reason, she really, really, really likes these bacon ones. I never thought cats really ate pigs. I guess big cats would. Her second favorite is this. It's a Purina Beyond. It's just a canned food. She really likes these canned food. She gets very excited for them. So, uh, we try to give her like half a can maybe every other night. She would like it all the time. Okay, the tail, tail's driving me crazy. Okay, say bye. Say bye. Bye. Okay, she's done. Okay, you want to go? Go. Okay, you can go. So my favorite, one of my favorite things that I have discovered, I, didn't, I mean, I guess I didn't discover this month, but I discovered that I like it this month. Okay, Cookie, you can go. Go. This is not for you. Okay, this is a sparkling water, and it has no added, uh, like no added sugars, no, nothing. It's just, literally, it's just water and natural flavor. No sugar, nothing. Now there's cat hair getting on my can. That's kind of gross. Cookie, that's enough. Okay, it's enough. This is not for you. Watch. So... Okay, evidently she thinks it's for her. Okay, scoot this way. If you want to stay here, scoot this way. Okay. So anyway, it doesn't really matter what the brand is. This is, I'm afraid I'm going to say it wrong, Schweppes. Schweppes? I don't know. Usually I buy the LaCroix brand. LaCroix? I don't know. LaCroix? LaCroix? Uh, that brand. I like their grapefruit. That is my favorite one so far. And sometimes you want something different than just plain water. And so I decided to try these. In general, I have not liked the flavored waters. Uh, but this one, it she she's trying to get her treats. Okay, Cookie, go. Go, go down. Go upstairs. You okay? Yeah, you're fine. Okay. I had to get off there. She was, her tail was getting a little bit crazy in my face. Ariana said you feel cool when you drink it. I'm on the topic of food. I'm going to do all the food things first. Uh, I showed this in my grocery haul video. It's just uh, Campbell's. It's called the Weld Yes. And it has uh, no artificial things in it. It's, a, it's better than like the regular canned soup. Basically, I keep this in case Ariana wants soup to take to school or if somebody gets sick and we just need something and I don't have the stuff on hand to make it. So I buy this when it's on sale. Okay, so this is my only other food item. Uh, I really like granola, and this is called Woats, and these were in Target a while ago, and then they, they clearanced out, and so I figured the brand just kind of went kaput or something, and they're very soft, and I prefer like the softer granola. Uh, this one is supposed to be Peanut Butter Graham Slam, and the granola is really good. What's not so great is that it doesn't taste like peanut butter, and I like peanut butter. When I see Peanut Butter Grand Slam, I expect for it to taste a lot like peanut butter, and this one definitely did not really taste like peanut butter. I, I don't really hardly taste any peanut butter in it, but this is a good brand. Just don't buy them all until you try it. Oh, the cat came back. Okay, now I'm going to show you some bathroom items. This is... Um, just a L'Oreal, basically a detangler, must have for these 
girls with long hair or boys with long hair, long hair in general, must have some sort of a detangler. Uh, I've tried like some off brands and they just don't work as well. Um, Suave is good too, but this one is the Sweet Pear. It's now paraben free. Uh, must have that. Okay, the next thing that um, I found at actually Walmart was this Mr. Bubble and it's called Magic Bath Crackles. Okay, so basically you get in the bath and you just pour it in and it is Pop Rocks for the bathtub. Pretty cool. This was pretty fun. We had it one, this is our, this is the other, I bought two of them just to try them out. And they were fun. I mean, it lasts like maybe five minutes and then it's done. But it was not even a dollar. So it's a fun thing to do. Okay, next. Uh, I'm a big chapstick person or lip gloss or whatever. I don't like my lips to be dry, basically. And so I go back and forth between some certain brands. And I don't like the chapstick ones that are really thick that feel sticky. So this one is just a Blistex, and normally I don't usually get this brand, but this one, look, it's called Soft and Lush, and actually it's really nice. It's, it smells good, doesn't have like a weird smell, it doesn't, you know, it's not minty, it's, mine's almost, it's actually almost gone, I haven't had it that long, and it's just uh, clear or whatever. Uh, so this is a really good one, I don't know if it's new or not, it also has SPF in it. And I have burned my lips before in the sun, so I try to, especially when it starts getting uh, more sunny out, try to get it with SPF. This, my friend, this is, the cap is dirty. I think my kids sometimes go in my makeup and squirt it. Um, my friend on YouTube here, actually in real life as well, is EJ Chris. I'll put her channel down below. She recommended this to me. It's the L'Oreal True Match Lumi. Lumi? and it's called the healthy luminous makeup and it also has 20 SPF in it and I actually do like this it's more of it says I think it's supposed to be like a medium coverage I don't really even see where it says um, the only thing it's it's good it's very light so it's, you don't feel like you're like like have sticky thick makeup on I do like it especially for the summer because I don't wear a lot of makeup in the summer so this is a good one to throw on so that one is good. Oh, I almost forgot. I had a favorite Netflix. My favorite Netflix of the month was called The Good Witch. I think it's The Good Witch or Good Witch. Uh, okay, it's not a scary show. It's not actually witchy at all. It's not, you don't see anybody doing like crazy weird things. It's a Hallmark show, I believe. It's on Netflix, really. So I will say goodbye right here. Cookie and I. Cookie, say bye, look up, say bye. Don't forget to subscribe and click that bell.